It's a long-standing tradition in Newport News for elected officials, Congressman Bobby Scott's annual Labor Day cookout. Our Kara Dixon was there as residents and voters got a chance to speak with their representatives. Despite today's heats, hundreds gathered here at Congressman Scott's home to meet and speak with their elected officials. There were plenty of handshakes and hamburgers to go around this Labor Day. No matter how important you think you are, the number of people at your funeral will depend on the weather. So depending on the weather, uh, it looks like pretty good weather, so we ought to get a pretty good crowd. And that's what Congressman Bobby Scott wants to see. Residents enjoying the holiday and the company of elected officials. We enjoy the opportunity for the elected officials to meet with the community, community and meet with the elected officials, and it's a great occasion. It's very exciting. Right, one on one. Gregory Baker would know. He's been at everyone for the past 42 years. I get bigger and bigger. So that's good. But the crowd isn't the only thing that's big. This fall's election is too, according to Scott and Senator Tim Kaine, who are both up for re-election. And the energy is good, the crowds are good, and what you want to see is energy. Elections are about energy, and we feel good about it right now. It's been a busy weekend for Kaine, hitting more than a dozen events. He says voters have Senator John McCain on their minds, and... A lot of discussion about health care, but I'm just, at everywhere I go, my theme is a Virginia that works for all. It's about Virginia, it's about work, which is especially important over Labor Day weekend, and it's for all, those last two words in the Pledge of Allegiance. Scott says the outcome of the election will depend a lot on the federal level, but for now, officials and their constituents have a little bit of time to sit back and enjoy the holiday before the final race to the polls. In Newport News, Kara Dixon, 10 on your side.